energies and roles can be reversed, okay? So this could be you or somebody around you, but if somebody's disgusted or like really offended here by something. I don't know. <clears throat> yeah, you're not happy with something. Mm -hmm. Okay. Looks like there's something to be proud about, though. Mm. We'll see what this is about. Show me for the collective when it comes to love here. What's going on for them? Mm, somebody, Page of Swords energy. Somebody is spying, lurking. This could be you looking for more information, trying to get more information. Somebody's trying to find out the, the gossip. Or, oh, it's a, um, hold on, y'all. This third party. Somebody's third party could be looking at you, trying to get more information about you, or you could be trying to find out. Some of y'all may have found out somebody is seeing somebody else. You you don't have to be married to this person. You don't have to have a label on it. I don't know. You could have a label on it. However this fits, apply it, okay? Someone could be finding out here that somebody is dealing with somebody else and they whatever information they go looking for, they're not going to be happy with it, okay? Or somebody is getting in the middle trying to find some dirt on you. A third party could be trying to get dirt find some information out to try to sabotage something. Mercury retrograde. We are in Mercury retrograde right now. Somebody here is real manipulative. I don't like this energy. This is giving me Queen of Wands energy in reverse. There's a jealous energy here. There's a jealous energy here that's mad. I feel like that's mad at somebody doesn't want your person to be interested in you. Or they're trying to figure out, well, why why is my person, you know, and they don't even have to have a label. They could just be casually seeing somebody. I don't know. But whoever this is, they're trying to put, trying to either A, lie on, lie on you, give your person negative information or gossip about you. Either way, it's giving manipulative and jealous. Hmm. So this is definitely happening sometime during Mercury retrograde. This could have already happened or will happen. And we're in Mercury retrograde through the 1st or 2nd of, of January, I believe. Don't quote me on that, but I'm pretty close to close to it. So somebody definitely lying to somebody here. And whatever information is going to be found out, somebody's not going to be happy with the information or your person is going to find out that somebody lied and they're going to be real pissed with them. Show me more about the situation, please. Six of Wands. Two of Swords. That's too many, please. Nine of Cups. Four of Swords. Too many spirit. I don't want all those. One at a time, please. Air sign. You could be a, a Gemini, Libra, or an Aquarius. You don't have to be. Page of Pentacles in reverse. Damn. Somebody made a wrong decision. For some of y'all, for those of you who, or this is your person, somebody chose the wrong person and whoever it is that they chose, I feel like this person lied on you uh, or convinced your person to choose them, but they were just a thieving, lying, manipulative, immature, irresponsible, I don't know. Somebody could have painted themselves as being someone who's the, like, oh, I'm doing this. Oh, I'm doing that. Oh, I got this going on. Oh, I got that going on. And they don't have shit going on. They don't have anything going on. What they do have going on is they'll lie, cheat, gossip just to get make themselves look good and to make you look bad i feel like you're showing up as this queen somebody here play games i don't know who this is there's a dispute or an argument or something somebody here is even a bully i don't know who's dealing with a bully or not somebody here is dealing with a damn bully 
and somebody created some form of con con conflict and I feel like someone here is realizing somebody created some form of conflict or they created a situation where there really wasn't one. Somebody made some drama and, and it's like... Mm -mm. I feel like this is definitely jealousy here with this nine of cups because I feel like collective you are actually doing good. Y'all sitting pretty. You're doing good. You know what I'm saying? You look good. You're doing great. But I feel like there's somebody else here in this person's energy or, or your energy that um, don't want you to don't want just I feel like there's someone here who didn't want you to be seen. Like, they don't like the fact that you're in the public eye or you're doing good or whatever. And whoever this person is dealing with, Queen of Wands, energy in reverse, jealous of you, you're the person who actually has a lot going on. I feel like male or female, okay? You could be a masculine or you could be a feminine. I feel like you're the one who's achieving things. You have goals. You've achieved a certain level of success and you get recognition for that. Like, you're a very successful person. And, but somebody here doesn't want to see you successful or they're trying to paint a picture like you're not successful. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Four swords is here in reverse. So it's like, I don't know. Somebody here is trying to receive what it is. I feel like your person is going to see this for what it is at some point. They're going to see what it is. They want to come out of the cold because and talk to you and they're realizing like, oh, shoot, like I was bamboozled or I was manipulated or lied to. And so now they want to try to recover this loss or overcome something. And now they want your forgiveness and they want to come out of the cold here with you with this five of pentacles in reverse energy. But here's the thing, the five of swords is here upright. Like somebody is still playing games. There's a feminine here, queen of swords energy. Somebody here is still playing damn games. Um, Five of cups, somebody regrets this or this feminine is going to regret doing this shit because it's definitely going to come out. Somebody being found out. Somebody here is like going to move on away from the shit they're washing their hands they're like oh well what can i do now i need to move on you know let me can I, let's clarify some of these all right spirit clarify the four swords in reverse please why is that here why is the four swords here in reverse Ooh, that's too many. Why is the four of swords here in reverse? Give me one card, please. Thank you. Four of swords in reverse is <laughs> the world card in reverse. Oh, boy. I'm telling you. It's an energy here of somebody being successful, having victory, getting attention, recognition, and then there's an energy of somebody here that's not getting the recognition. They feel empty inside. There is definitely a lack of closure in the situation. This person is definitely, whoever this other person is, they don't, they're not getting, they tried to sell themselves as something they weren't. Show me more about this four swords on reverse. And, and low key, hold on y'all. Six of Pentacles upright and the Eight of Swords in reverse. Somebody is breaking free from the person who lied about this. Somebody is getting their freedom. They're taking their control back and they are, yeah. Yeah. Clarify the Six of Pentacles. I just feel like Clarify the Six of Pentacles. Uh-oh. Hold on, y'all. I dropped the card. Ace of Cups. Ace of Cups. Somebody wants to give to you and release themselves from this other person. They know they made a reckless decision. Aries energy, Aquarius energy here on the bottom of the deck. The fool in reverse. They didn't trust their intuition. 
whatever this was is coming out. It's definitely coming out. Okay, clarify this Queen of Swords. Why is the Queen of Swords here? The lovers in reverse. Yeah, they made this person rate your person made the wrong choice. There's, this is the person creating the conflict. This is the person that they're trying to detach from. Gemini energy could be a Gemini. I mean, mm -mm. show me the Queen of Swords, please. This a no-no. The moon, I told you, it reversed. I told you. Someone, he, I'm telling you, this person did not listen to themselves. They know full well what this they allow somebody to sell them a dream. They allow, they listen to somebody else and they knew this wasn't true about you. So now this person is trying to gain their composure and free themselves from this shit because they really want to bring something to you. I feel like this other person at some point is going to try to apologize to you. The third party is going to try to talk to you or apologize to you to like, uh, how can I put this? Like call a truce or apologize to you or some shit. And y'all are not going to want an apology. You don't want to talk to this person. Look at this, the tower. Something unexpected is happening. To Scorpio energy, cancer energy, Gemini energy is here. Um, Tell me about this tower. Shit is gonna hit the fan when this when this comes out if it hasn't come out already. <coughs> Show me the tower. Seven of Wands. I'm telling you, this person has been defeated. They are going to be forced <coughs> to 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 be honest and be like, yeah, I lied. This is the energy of I'm caught red handed. There was nothing I could do to try to cover this up. This is somebody admitting something, somebody bringing something to, to somebody. I, I don't, show me this Ace of Cups, please. Hold on. They may have known your person wanted to reconcile with you. And they could have, that's why they created these lies. Well, clarify the Ace of Cups. Ace of, yeah, they did. That they created these lies, Ace of Swords. I clarified this Ace of Cups. That's what I was getting. That somebody knew they wanted to, this, this, your person wanted to bring a love offer to you, but they created these lies and said, created this gossip or whatever it, it is. They tried to create this confusion, this illusion, um, and, and, and this chaos and this conflict to stop your person from giving them, giving you what they want. Yep. And look at what just fell out. Five of Wands. Let's clarify this Ace of Swords in reverse. All this person did was lies. Get ready to come out. The tower is here. The moon is here in reverse. Somebody about to get caught red-handed. They're going to have to admit it. Clarify the Ace, the Ace of Swords in reverse, please. Lying ass. Six of Swords. Yeah. When this truth comes out, this person's leaving this karmic. This person is leaving this fucking karmic. Some of y'all that's moving out. For some of y'all that's coming towards you. Yeah, King of Cups in reverse. Mm -hmm. This person, you know, they're going to withdraw from this person. They finding out this person. They are moving away from whoever the hell this was that was manipulative as hell. And this King of Cups is a female. In this deck... This King of Cups is a female. They could be a Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio. <coughs> Somebody could have braids, blue hair. Some of y'all. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah. That's a no. <coughs> Somebody's plan did not work. Two of Wands in reverse. The plan didn't work. The plan did not work. It did not work. It was a bad plan. Two of Wands in reverse. Somebody's ass is found the fuck out for this. Show me more. <clears throat> and now your person is like, it didn't mean anything to me. I didn't really. So your person may want to come towards you and say that, that the karmic didn't mean anything to them. 
some of y'all this car they put they chose this person not because of love they chose this karmic over money or something that this karmic sold to them or lied to them and said that they had or lied to them and told them oh i'm doing this i have this going on i have that going on no the, it could be further from the damn truth that's a lie this karmic did not have anything going on matter of fact bank account on zeros and draft uh what you call them things overdraft yeah, and this for now your person wants to apologize for believing or choosing a karma over you. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> so I feel like this person's ego, part of the reason why this person chose this karma in addition to them lying and being manipulative, because let's keep it real, like your person made a choice. So there is some accountability on your person's part. Um, but they really did this to be petty because you did something. Maybe y'all, some of y'all set boundaries with this person or you did something to set boundaries or you were not like, you know, whatever it is that you, you were doing. I feel like you weren't doing what this karmic was doing. You set healthy boundaries with this person. You made them work for whatever it is, or you may have challenged this person to be better and do better. And they, at the time it was them being karmic -y and in their shadow self deciding not to grow to heal or to expand or ascend and they were like well since the collective want me to do xyz this seems like too much work is easier over here with this karmic who say they got xyz i don't have to worry about blah 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 um they felt like low-key you hurt them but this was them being petty i really believe and now they want you to take them back and they want you they want to apologize to you and they're hoping you're gonna take them back so y'all aren't with this person right now. You're minding your business. Sitting in a lap of luxury. Independent. Toxic. Yeah. This, I'm going to tell you, part of the manipulation this karmic used with your other person, which I believe is a masculine, um, they moved extremely fast. They rushed everything so this person couldn't have, didn't have time to think or make good, better decisions. I feel like they rushed this person or just, it, I don't know, I, maybe that'll resonate. Y'all don't know what I'm talking about, but let me get a few more, please. <clears throat> yeah, your person wants to come back towards you and, um... They definitely chose money over love. They weren't ready to commit. And they're not ready to let you go right now. I, I, you know, um, yeah, this person's really upset with you. Whatever y'all said to this person hurt them, hurt their ego. And, it, and that was part of the reason why they ran back to this karmic who didn't have shit. Your person didn't trust their intuition. They ran to somebody else because they got mad at you because you said what needed to be said. I feel like or you did what needed to be done. Yeah. So they ran back towards a manipulative karmic. Well. <laughs> show me more about the situation um, between this karmic and this divine masculine. Look at what just came out. Negative mindset. Not able to see the light. That's the, your person not trusting their intuition. Okay. Reaching rock bottom. Pessimistic attitude towards love. Stuck in their own self-limiting mindset. This was your person... Um, refusing to heal, refusing to grow, right? You you challenged them. They didn't want to be challenged. So they didn't have to do any work. It was easier over there with the karmic. But really, your person, you know, could have been dealing with this karmic. Could have been a narcissist. So hell, maybe your person and the karmic is narcissist. The both of their ass is narcissist. Self-absorbed. Definitely somebody here was playing mind games. Trying to gaslight, love bomb, confuse you. I feel like, yep, dark magic. This is a karmic too. I do still feel like the divine masculine to some degree to hold them accountable. They were definitely narcissists because they didn't want to listen to what you had to say. They didn't want to heal and level up and ascend and grow and be a better person and do the work. So they ran over here with this karmic 
at Carmelita, right? And then, look at this. She did dark magic. He did dark magic. Yeah, just, just, just using energy to do spell work to try to keep your person stuck. Acting like they had something, but they didn't have any money. Bank account on overdraft. No. Negative. Using, yeah, sex magic and dark magic. Look at this. That's the karmic. Trying to keep your person stuck. Succubus ass spirit. Using sex to control this masculine. For some of y'all, they had unprotected sex with this person. Child. <sighs> All right. You're doing good. But your person is sad. At the decisions and disappointed in themselves. They're sick and offended and repulsed. When they, if they haven't found this information out about this karma yet, honey, they, they're going to find out and they're going to be sick to their stomach when this comes out. You could be dealing with um, a Gemini, for sure, Libra or an Aquarius here, uh, Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio, any, any, um, any fixed sign, Leo, Taurus, Scorpio, Aquarius, but your person could be anybody, honey, I don't know. It's definitely all going to unfold before Mercury retrograde is over because Mercury retrograde energy is here. All right. So, child, that's your reading. I love y'all. Hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel. Join us on Patreon. The link is below in the description box if you need a personal reading or if you want to join us on Patreon where we do Divine Masculine, Divine Feminine readings, Twin Flame readings. Um, they get extra readings over there too. Um, happy holidays. I love y'all. Okay. Bye.